Hello my lovely, lovely Leos. Happy, happy birthday. This is an exciting month, so let me take you through it. It starts out with a full moon happening in your seventh house of relationships. So this is shining a light on everything to do with how you are in your relationships. Full moons often bring changes. So maybe somebody who was not so close to you becomes closer to you. Something can come to a head in a relationship. You might start a new relationship. You might complete the form of an existing relationship. But in some way you're being asked, what do I need to change? How do I need to be differently? How do I need to reinvent my relationships so that they're more nourishing for both me and the other party? On the fifth of the month, we've got Mercury coming to join the sun in your sign. It's birthday time. And also on the 18th of the month, we've got a lovely new moon happening in your sign, Leo. So this is your time. This is your new year. What do you want for this new year? How do you want to rebirth yourself? What are the new things that you want? It's a real opportunity for planting new seeds, for bringing anything new, a new inspiration into your life. The one thing about you lovely Leos is you're super duper creative. And it's really important to really let that creativity out. Don't say I'm not creative. Just say, how can I be creative? And how do you find that? Then you look at the things that you enjoy and you just, you just start doing more of them. I'd like to share with you what my lovely, lovely Elvira, uh, lovely Leo did. Look what she created for me, this beautiful treble clef. She made it, it's so beautiful, it's made with so much love and I carry it with me so many places, yeah? And that's from a lovely creative Leo. She just let her Leo energy fly. So how about you letting your Leo energy fly? We need that kind of creative, fun, excited energy. We need it more than ever now as our earth goes through these big changes. And as you go through these big changes and become more of who you are, expressing more of your talents and more of your potential. On the 8th of the month, we've got Venus coming into this 12th house. Uh, this is a wonderful time for uh, having peaceful, quiet time alone. There's all the excitement of birthday, but nonetheless, good to center and ground yourself and really great for anything to do with metaphysics, esoterics, aliens, channeling, psychic stuff, going deeper into the subconscious, astrology, Wonderful for all those things. And somebody from your past may come back into your life. On the 20th of the month, we've got Mercury coming into the 5th. And on the 23rd, the, uh, to the 2nd, sorry. And on the 23rd, the Sun. So this shining light on your finances. An opportunity maybe to create a new source of income. And maybe to make that hobby or that thing that you do creatively, to do it uh, for money. You can create uh, an income stream from it. It's also a good time to really strut your stuff, Leos. Leo, you're the lion. Think about that beautiful, beautiful animal. What can you express of the lion in your life, especially as it's birthday time? All month we've got Mars in this ninth house, going to be there for several months. Next month going retrograde, but more about that in next month's forecast. And so Mars in the ninth, really good time for putting energy into your spiritual growth, what inspires you, putting energy into the meaning of life. Why have we got this virus? Why are we having all these earth changes? What is your place in them? All these great questions. It's a great time for studying, for learning to take your knowledge to a much higher, higher level. And all in all, a good time for connecting with people, for making connections with people far and wide, not just locally, internationally, 
and even out into outer space and beyond. You might be experimenting with energy healing, frequencies, the quantum world. So I hope that you like that I've gone back to this original format. Many of you didn't like the format of having them all, all the forecasts in one video. Of course, this is a, a huge amount of work, which I love, love, love. And I must thank so many of you who are supporting me on Patreon. Thank you. Even for those of you just who give a, a, a dollar a month, that makes a big difference. And for those of you who like and join me on the live chats and subscribe and comment, everything makes a difference. So thank you for joining me and I wish you a wonderful birthday. Bye for now.